Hello guys, Adam we live and I'm gonna show you real quick because someone was telling me in the tutorial how do I use the scale and core um, MIDI effects and there's so many of these um, useful utilities that no one uses and it's very easy to use what you do is you take a chord, let's say I'm going to take house to go and put it in here and then I'm going to open up another MIDI note, a MIDI channel, excuse me, and then I'm going to put it in the virus. You can use anything besides the virus. You can use other instruments or stuff like that like VSTs and it will work the same and what you're going to do is you're going to take in here and let's say now I want to put the scale but right now I'm going to show you real quick how you do the the input for this go to input here and you'll see when I put in a note to do you record this. This is coming out from one single note. Now I have these chords recorded, and what I can do is just leave it in the instrument, and then I can just delete this channel right here. But if you want to go into leaving in, staying in the scale of the chord, I will put in this right here, and then we will put in, let's say. Blue scale. As you can see, it changed one of the notes. These two notes are changed. Why? Because it's because it's right now in uh, blue scale. But if I was to go into the house scale or just a minor scale or a minor chord, it will stay in the minor scale here or well, blue scale. And sorry, I'm just getting all confused. I have right now the blue scale on, but if I go here and change the chord to a minor, and leave it on C. As you can see, it will change. 
and notes. And this is all just to record from a single note, single note MIDI, and you try to get some chords out of it, but maintaining inside the scale by leaving this on. If you want to go into minor scale, So now we got two different scale going on. So now I can delete this and now I can just play around with this, with these scales. Control click on the Mac, control and click with your mouse, and then, and I think is with right click on a Windows, is right clicking the right button, and then you have this small menu, and then you just rack it up.
that's how you do the scale. If you still have doubts on how to do it, it's not that hard to do it. I'll repeat it again just to show you real quick how it is. Um, I'm going to leave this channel, open up a MIDI channel, then put in, go into your MIDI effects section and then go where it says house, put that in and then go where it says scale and then you put in a minor, C minor, but you can always change this to an F or whatever it is. Like let's say right now, um, input right here and then just hold this and then put in
and that's how you um, record scales from a single note which is this well it was that and that's about it guys have a good one take care peace